this crochet assembly today we are going to see how to make this knot for that first open cut here then go on start then mechanical design and then part design now click on ok and we are going to use all same dimensions as given in figure so that first you have to select any plane i am selecting top plane and then go on sketch option from here now you have to first make one hexagon so this is our hexagon and now let's see dimensions and distance between uh, first you have to use this constant command from here distance between two parallel edges is given at 60 and now you have to make one circle and here is the constraint command again and the thickness uh, diameter is given to us as 30 after that go on exit to workbench and now here here is a pad command select pad command and take thickness as 35 it is given in figure now here is the main skill you can see these three planes here we have to select the plane which is going through two uh, vertex not through the edges see this plane is going through these two edges but this plane is going through this, this two vertex so we have to select this plane so select it and then go on sketch option from here now here you have to use this projection where is the, this is the projection command you have to select it and just project this two sides after selecting these two sides you have to go on chamfer command here is the uh, i mean corner command so select both of this and now the diameter is given to us uh, radius is given to us as 10 so right here 10 and after that take this profile command and complete the entity so we can trim it now you have to go on exit to workbench and now uh, th where is this is shaft command but we don't want to use it because we have to use this groove command shaft is just for adding material and groove is just for removing material so we have to remove unwanted so after that uh, uh, axis should be selected so we have to select axis and then take preview or directly click on ok this is how we have completed our uh, nut thank you so much guys for watching it